We recently had a problem in our home where when we turned on the bathtub faucet and then tried to return it to an off position, it continued to run. So I knew something was wrong with the inner workings of the actual uh, faucet handle, but I didn't know how to get to it because there was no um, exposed screw that I've seen on a lot of faucet handles. So through trial and error, what I found is if you hold the handle in place, there's going to be another part somewhere within this fixture that will spin to un unscrew the actual piece. So I'm holding the handle and just screwing counterclockwise or left to remove the handle. And what we found is there's a screw here on the inside. I don't know if you could see that in the camera, but it had gotten loose. So when you turn the faucet handle, it didn't actually activate um, this little knob in the faucet handle. So to turn it off in the short term, you can simply take a wrench and then catch the square edges of the faucet uh, inner workings and turn it off to the right or turn it on to the left. So that's a good stop gap to get your water off and then to get it back on you just repeat the process but make sure that you screw in tightly that uh, interior uh, screw. I will say uh, it was pretty scary to see how plastic everything is in here. So if you have a faucet that you feel like you're turning um, very aggressively, I'd be very careful and try to do it slowly and maybe get some WD-40 in there um, because this is very brittle plastic it feels like and could easily snap. Um, the other thing I found is that this piece here has kind of like a gear inner working. And so when you reattach it, if it doesn't um, lay flush so that the handles are facing the same direction for the off position, you can tweak where the handle will fall when it's completely tightened by moving, the moving this out and turning the gears. So thanks a lot for watching, I hope this helps.